guys, today I'm going to show you how to make a galaxy painting. Um, what you'll need is watercolor, like a watercolor palette, a paintbrush, a water cup, a piece of watercolor paper, and white paint that's not watercolor paint. That's either acrylic or tempera. Um, acrylic is probably the best, just regular white paint. Okay, so to start, and maybe a pencil. So to start, what we're gonna do is we're gonna draw like a um, like a round shape at the bottom of the page. Okay. Okay. So the way I'm gonna do it, like this is gonna be the Earth. This is gonna be the galaxy. You can be a little bit creative with this, like if you want um, to show people or plants or something else totally up to you okay so I think for me that's just gonna be um, green maybe some brown so it looks earthy So the watercolor paint lets us kind of um, mix colors really easily. It's really liquidy and blends easily. Okay. So that's my base. As that dries, I think it's just gonna look like um like an earthy <laughs> shape. Okay, so then for the galaxy, I want it to be like dark blues and blacks and maybe a little purple. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of water on those colors. Okay, so I'm gonna try to show you what I'm doing as I paint it and trying to secure my camera. Okay, so I put a little dot of blue there, and then I'm going to spread it out. I'm going to keep adding to it. This is not the best watercolor paper, but you guys should have um, like different paper that's really, really good for using watercolor on. Okay, so I'm kind of right now just putting some colors, like some blues and some pinks that I think are going to blend together to make the kind of color I want. Um, and I'm kind of using a, like a little more water than I would normally use just because I want it, um, like the more water that's there, the more these colors are blending together. I'm mix some black too, right? Cause we want this to be nighttime or I want it to be nighttime. If you don't, that's totally fine. my camera that's so annoying when that happens okay I'm just gonna make sure I paint the whole page see how my paper is curling up like that that's because it's not watercolor paper um, like I said you guys should have watercolor paper which is thicker and shouldn't do that At this point, as we're as the um, we're gonna give the sky some time to dry, and then like if you wanted to go back and put something over here, um, like on Earth is what I'm calling that. If you wanted to put something else on Earth, now would be 
like as the rest, as the sky dries would be a really good time to go back and do that. these colors are blending together. I'm just putting some extra water because I like, like I like the way they, it bleeds like that. Okay. And again, this would be much better if I had a little bit thicker paper. careful when you're making the sky that you don't add too many other colors like I'm adding like blue and purple um but just so it doesn't end up like getting like really brown so I don't want to add um like yellow or green because then it might turn turn brown and that's not what we want okay so this is kind of where I think I want to stop. So I'm just letting it mix around a little bit. And then if I wanted to go back here to the bottom and draw some things like, um, anything, anything you want really, like you can draw a little, I'm gonna draw a little tree. Like if you wanted to make a person like looking up can basically anything that you would see on earth would make sense to go there okay just some little little trees I think that's all I'm going to do and I'm just gonna wait for the um, top to dry a little bit A while to dry and that's completely fine what I'm doing now I'm just letting it drip a little bit just because I like the way that looks okay so then when this is dry I'm gonna brush through it a little bit just to show you when this is dry you can take the regular white paint um, and a clean brush and a dry brush is really better to do this with and you're gonna flick it see how that's sprinkling okay so this is it's not working great because it is wet but let me just show you on a different um, piece of paper so like on this plain pink paper oops, Right, so what I'm doing is I'm flicking it. It's a little bit too wet, sorry guys. So you're like flicking it and it's making like little white dots, um, which is going to look like stars. that okay so right now it is bleeding a little bit I'm getting it on my on my camera okay and then I will show you this when it's done I'll just I'll show a picture um, 
this is how it looks so far. Okay, so that's kind of the background we're getting. And um, if you guys have like glitter, you could add a little bit of glitter to the background. It's completely up to you. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that.